got an idea, and I wanted to run it by you. What's on your mind? With so many human colonies being attacked, I'm not sure that one specter is enough. What if you signed me on as another specter? E Conrad, I don't think that's a good idea. But I'd make a great specter. I'd be right there with you, showing the Council what humanity is capable of. I read about what you did on Torfin. I'm not afraid to do whatever it takes to get the job done. Conrad, you have no idea what it takes to get the job done. What? No, please. Please don't hurt me. Why are you doing this? Because you're not a soldier, Conrad. You can't handle this. Go home. I thought you were a hero. Heroes don't do things like this. I wish I'd never met you. Commander, I've got an idea, and I wanted to run it by you. What's on your mind? With so many human colonies being attacked, I'm not sure that one specter is enough. What if you signed me on as another specter? E Conrad, I don't think that's a good idea. But I'd make a great specter. I'd be right there with you, showing the Council what humanity is capable of. I read about what you did on Torfin. I'm not afraid to do whatever it takes to get the job done. If you're really willing to do whatever it takes, you'll go home, Conrad. What? I, I don't understand. You know what keeps me going out here? Knowing that people back home are keeping humanity strong. You... You're right. I just got so caught up in all of it. I wanted to help. I'll go home. Thanks for setting me straight. Alliance officials report that a Geth incursion into the Armstrong Cluster has been repulsed, with the Geth suffering heavy casualties. In the event of future Geth activity, the Alliance plans to maintain a strong security presence in the area. Hey, been a long time, huh? Have we met? Uh, I, I guess you don't remember me. Lieutenant Zabaleta? I, I worked with your mother. We served on the carrier Einstein. Well, that was 12, 13 years back, though. You were just a kid then. I guess you're not in the service anymore, huh? <laughs> you retired, yeah. You know how it is. Times are tough for vets. They always are. I didn't see her much that tour. The ship was on patrol most of the time. Hey, call your mom up and ask. She'd remember old Zabaleta. She'd vouch for me. Look, I need a favor. I'm kind of short on money these days. I hate hitting you up for money, but a man's gotta eat, right? So, could you spare something? Maybe 20 credits. You are barking up the wrong shepherd. Maybe my mother would help you. I think you'll just blow it on booze. I'm not a bad guy, kid. I just took my share of lumps. Don't judge me. You ever want to come by and talk? I'll be here. Huh? <laughs> Can't afford a ticket home, right? You ever just sit and watch? So how are you liking your posting at the academy? It's good. Busy, though. I can't believe how many people you get coming in from the wards. Yeah, it's the busiest station on the Citadel. We'll never get bored. I guess not. Alliance officials have raided a dangerous cult controlled by a former Alliance officer, Major Kyle. 
Major Kyle and his cultists refused to surrender and were killed in the resulting firefight. Your Noveria report raised a few eyebrows in the Council, Shepard. I can't believe you let that queen live. There's a reason their species was nearly wiped out. You should have finished them off. You weren't there, Ambassador. It was my call. I did the right thing. Really? I'm glad you're an expert in a species we know virtually nothing about. I hope we're both still around in 50 years to see if you're right. Genocide of an entire species is a terrible tragedy, Ambassador. Shepard did the right thing. Fine. I'll just tell everyone we figured it was a good idea to release a fertile Rachni queen in the wilds of Novaria. I'm sure nobody will have a problem with that. Yes, Commander? How are you holding up? Honestly, this isn't how I pictured my career coming to it, but you're the one who can stop, Saren. I believe in you, Shepard. If that means I have to step aside, so be it. I should go. I'll be here if you need anything. A research station on Novaria has reportedly been destroyed. The exact cause is currently unknown. Given the research conducted on Novaria, many are blaming the destruction on an experiment gone awry. Administrator Anoleus currently faces criminal charges as a result of the disaster, although the nature of the charges remains unclear. Treaty negotiations between the Alliance and the Salarian Republic have finally concluded. Salarians praised the openness and flexibility of Alliance negotiators in pursuing a deal that benefited both sides. The deal was brokered by new Alliance negotiator Thomas Kent after his mentor Elias Keeler withdrew, citing health reasons. Logged. The commanding officer is aboard. Exo Presley stands relieved. Computer, give me a real-time connection to the dreadnought Kilimanjaro. I want to speak to my mother, Exo Shepard. Shepard speak? Oh, hi. I don't have time for a personal call right now. I'm on duty. Forget it. I'm busy, too. Do you remember a Lieutenant Zabaleta from the Einstein? Ernesto? Have you heard from him? 
He was one of the Marines who guarded the CIC. We shared a watch. I lost track of him after there was an incident. What kind of incident? You remember the Batarian raid on Mindwar in 2170? You were in high school. The Einstein's task group responded to the May Day. The Batarians were still pulling out when the Marines hit groundside. Sabaleda was one of the first down. He... he was never quite the same after. I don't understand. What happened down there? About every abomination that a sentient being can do to another. To a slaver, a person is just another animal. And humans aren't always liked out here. We heard about corralling, uh, culling. They'd shoot those they couldn't use, implant control devices in the skulls of those they could, without anesthetic. He has post-traumatic stress because of what he saw? He tried to keep working, but it rode him. He showed up drunk on duty more and more. We couldn't always cover for him. The Alliance discharged him. Everyone knew he drank because of what he'd seen down there, even if he never talked about it. Especially because he never talked about it. For it to have affected him that deeply, he must have been a very sensitive man. He was. Always in laughter and tears. If you see him, tell him we still worry about him. Tell him to go to the Veterans Affairs office. I have to go. But take care of yourself. You're making us proud. Kilimanjaro out. Commander, we've got an incoming distress signal. Patching through to you. Mayday! 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 This is Lieutenant Marie Durand, 314th Infantry, Alliance 10th Frontier Division. The listening post has been overrun by unidentified hostile life forms. Request immediate extraction. Thank you. 
I'm on my way. Yes, ma'am. I smell trouble. All targets down.
targets down. On your order. First Lieutenant Durand, ma'am. 3rd Brigade, 14th Infantry Regiment. And I am damn glad to see you. Shepard, Normandy, give me a sit rep. They dropped us here a few months back. We get supplies every couple weeks. We didn't see anything local that was more dangerous than lichen. Yesterday, these animals started coming out of the ground. No idea where they're from. This is what's left out of 90 men. I'm the ranking officer. We do have a ship in orbit. We could bombard them. Wouldn't do much good. They're moving around deep underground. The only time they come near the surface, and they're right on our position. You bombard them. You take us out, too. Why are you out here in the first place? There's been a lot of pirate activity in this cluster. We set up a chain of listening posts in the local systems, in case they have a staging base. They're not animals, they're ascension species. You study history? They're called rachni. Never heard of them. Can't say I care. What we just fought was a probe. Our seismic sensors are picking up a crapload more on their way up from underground. We've got five minutes, tops. We might be able to hold them off if we were at peak, but you can see the fighting's busted this place up. Do what you can to secure your position. We'll see if we can get some of your defenses operational. Aye, aye, Commander. You heard the woman. Everybody pool magazines and grenades. Take a leak and a drink while you can. And if anyone wants a smoke... I wish you were a tank brigade. No offense. Go, go, go! Not much time left, Commander. You must die! clear how are those repairs coming not much time left commander Take him down. Finally, some action.
Holy hell, ma'am. Talk about a near-run thing. You all right? I'm pissed off. When I get pissed off, I shoot things. Find me more bugs. <sighs> Around here, they're more likely to find you. There's one other thing I should mention. One of our other listening posts went offline three days ago. I don't know if it's coincidence, a pirate raid, or what. But if you want to check in on them... We'll check on them. I don't know why there are arachni loose out here, but I intend to find out. Ma'am, we're getting a signal from one of the ground scan UAVs. A big hollow space about 500 meters under the surface. Right, that must be it. That must be where they're coming from. My people aren't in any condition for a clearing operation, though. Just point us in the right direction. You don't have to do that, Commander. We've bled them. We can probably hold until a bigger ship arrives to get us off-world. If you want to take a throw at it, we'll give you the coordinates. But it's your call. You saved our asses, Commander. Thanks. I will destroy you! Take him out! All targets down. I think we're good, Commander.
Finally, some action! Target. Clear. <laughs> 